Hello and welcome, it's Spicy. Today we're doing kind of a different video. I stumbled across something quite interesting. I'll call it a trick instead of a glitch. I don't want this channel to be a glitching channel. So let's call it a trick, not a glitch. This is not a glitch. So I'll briefly explain how I stumbled across this trick. Actually thinking about it, it might be a glitch, but we're not gonna call it a glitch. Let's call it a trick. So it started off with me trying to farm some cigarette cards. We're probably all familiar with them. You're rewarded a cigarette card every time you pick up a premium cigarette pack. I quickly wanted to boost up my collection, so I thought why not buy a few from the general store. And immediately I found out that the general store doesn't seem to run out of stock, so you can just keep buying premium cigarette packs over and over again. If you're not familiar, every time you buy one you get a card and every time you buy a pack you get 10 cigarettes. The best way to get rid of these cigarettes is not by smoking them, they take too long. Just go into the satchel and discard the whole 20. So as you're seeing in the gameplay, every time I buy two, I discard all 20 and then rinse and repeat. But as I was doing this and racking up a few cards, I realised it was actually increasing my Deadeye level. I was getting 6 XP every time I bought one pack. After realising that I was racking up quite a bit of Dead Eye XP, I decided just to rinse and repeat this method, but I then I realised this method was far too slow, so I thought, how could I speed it up? Then I remembered that you could actually buy items individually, instead of having to open that catalogue and then skim through and then leave, which just took forever. You could go to the back and buy the premium cigarettes by themselves. So here we go, this is the method. You go up to the premium cigarettes, you buy two, you open your satchel, you discard them. Keep repeating that, you're getting six Dead Eye XP for each packet, so you get 12 XP each time. As it's only $3 a pack, this is quite a viable option. You are pretty much buying Dead Eye XP and cards. So one more time for those that didn't understand it, you go up to the premium cigarette pack, bear in mind you can only buy two at a time, they house 10 cigarettes, that's why you're saying 20 cigarettes, you're not actually, you don't actually own 20 packs, you own 20 cigarettes, so you buy two cigarette packs, you're awarded your two cards, you're awarded your 12 XP, hold right on the D-pad, you hover over the cigarettes, you press triangle to discard all 20 of them, you go back, you buy two, and then you rinse and repeat. And amazingly, the general store doesn't seem to run out of cigarettes, so you can just keep pumping this over and over again. To be honest, you're awarded so much money by just doing the main mission. Money isn't a problem, you can just keep spamming this over and over again. To definitely perfect this method, I would definitely recommend a high honour rating. The higher your honour rating, the higher the discount stores give you. As you can see in the gameplay, rather than being charged the five full dollars, I'm being charged a bit less because I've got a higher honor rating. So I'll definitely recommend that higher honor ratings for big discounts so it's less expensive when you're exploiting this trick. I would also definitely recommend this trinket that I'm showing on the screen. It seems to give 10% more XP to Deadeye. This trinket works wonders. I'll definitely recommend the honor and the trinket for this method. What makes this method so good is that it's pretty much two birds, one stone. Not only you're ranking up your XP in Deadeye, but you're also completing collections on the way. I literally just found this method an hour ago. If it was anything else, I'd have probably left it, but I've seen so many people struggle to level up their Deadeye. That was also a similar problem for me. I could easily level up my stamina and my health, but Deadeye was a lot harder to level up, so hopefully this is a viable option. Anyway, enough of that. I hope this method is useful for you. Please do tell me any other tricks, not glitches, tricks that you might know in the comment section down below. Please leave a like. Please do subscribe as well. Thanks again for watching. See you all later.